The terms GPU memory and dedicated GPU memory are often used interchangeably, but they can represent slightly different concepts depending on the context. Here are the possible meanings of these terms. GPU memory. This generally refers to the memory present on a graphics card, graphics processing unit, GPU. This memory is used to store data for graphics computations, including texture data, geometry data, and other information necessary for rendering images on the screen. Dedicated GPU memory. This term refers to the portion of a GPU's total memory that is exclusively reserved for the graphics card and is not shared with the system RAM of the computer. Dedicated GPU memory is typically faster and more efficient for graphics-intensive tasks since it can be accessed directly by the GPU without going through the system RAM. It's important to note that in some cases, dedicated GPU memory may also be used to refer to the exclusive memory space of an integrated graphics unit, e.g., in Intel or AMD CPUs, that is not shared with system RAM. In summary, GPU memory refers to the memory on a graphics card, while dedicated GPU memory may imply that this memory is exclusively reserved for the GPU and not shared with the computer's main memory. So, shared GPU memory is a virtual memory, an allocation of RAM, used by the integrated GPU or the dedicated GPU to handle graphics-intensive functions on a computer system. Whether you have an integrated GPU or a dedicated GPU, your system will allocate up to 50% of your system's memory to be used as shared GPU memory. Whether you truly need a graphics card with dedicated memory depends on the specific applications you intend to run on your PC. If high-end video applications are in your plans, a dedicated graphics card may be necessary. Dedicated GPU memory helps avoid graphical glitches that can occur with shared GPU memory and enhances overall graphics performance. It provides stable frame rates, faster texture loading, and reduces graphical pop-ins. Nevertheless, dedicated GPUs can be pricey. If your budget doesn't allow for a new graphics card, you can adjust window settings to reallocate system RAM as dedicated VRAM. Thanks for watching I hope it helped, like and subscribe.